So we're sitting here at the start line, you know, I, I can't thank uh, Clyde Stacy and Justin Matt enough for, for offering up their uh, their G6 geyser. Uh, this is a brand new truck that, uh, that they've been running for about the last four or five months. Uh, it's, it's new, it's got a couple races on it. Uh, it's ready to win. And after I crashed mine, we, we evaluated it and my truck was gonna show up on Thursday, you know, the day before the race and not really have any more testing time than what we put on it before the accident. And you know, I just felt that this was the right decision. Uh, the right decision for Toyo Tires, the right decision for KMC. Obviously for Robbie Gordon, uh, it's, a, it's an excellent opportunity to climb behind the wheel of this thing. And you know, I've won many races with these guys before, so I think our, our best shot at winning the 2019 Baja 1000 was in this truck.
tampoco no se ve el dinero. Yeah, we're ready. We're ready. Truck's coming uh, probably 45 minutes. We're just going to try to hold our position, try to not lose any time. Uh, hopefully others will lose their time. Hopefully we can we can make some positions. But uh, basically just uh, try to stay out of trouble and, and get it back to Robbie on the other side. Just give him a breather and let him hit, do his, his magic over there. The first places? Of course we are. Okay. All right. Huh? Our zero is exactly 50 minutes, huh? 446.8. We gotta call Cole, get the buggy out here. Mm -hmm. Get that. Yeah, we would just destroy that truck to go. Yeah. Oh. Uh, shit, you already got it, huh? Yeah. Are you on that map thing? Yeah. Are you on the tracking? Yeah. What do you see? Um, you guys are 440. All right, I got out at Morelia Junction, came over here to El Dorado, and uh, Potts picked me up there with their buggy, and uh, came back, got a shower, washed my uniform, cleaned my visor, clean helmet, should be good to go here. Um, you know, when not too long ago, we were right there with 11, and he's sitting there battling for third place right now, so um, I still think we got a shot at this. Uh, the 10 is on the gas, and Pudias are going awesome. Uh, setting a gnarly pace. It's going to be interesting to see if their truck will last that long run that hard.
felt good, but the water killed us. One plug on the throttle. When Robbie called, we went out there and took one plug off, cleaned it all out, plugged it back in. That took three or four hours downtime. So. Geyser Brothers truck, number 77, a legend down here in Baja, Mr. Robbie Gordon. Robbie, man, good to see you here. I know it had to be one heck of a day. What what happened out there? All right, we just finished up the Baja 1000. Um, 11 o'clock the next day. What is that? Um, I think we left at, I want to say we ended up leaving at 11.30ish, something like that, 11.20, so 24 hours later. Unfortunately, we were stopped for about six hours. And uh, that's a bummer because uh, we, we had a good car. Uh, we had a great car. RPM gave us a, a good car. Guys and Brothers did a great job. Had uh, one one fluke, fluke deal with uh, um, with a sensor for the TPS. Uh, got water in it and must have corroded. And started working partially and then it finally just shut off and we had no more. And uh, that's a bummer because uh, Truck ran good. Truck ran really good all day. Um, we cruised it probably a little too much early. Um, I got stuck in a rain rut. Lost about 10 minutes early. But um, besides that, real no no real issues. You know, um, we can't do this without without partners. And obviously, having um, Toyota tires on our team and, and KMC and and, uh, and everybody else. You know, VT Fuels. Everybody else helps us out. Couldn't do it without you guys. Thank you.